What's up guys, I'm Phoenix Master 1 and welcome to this week's Resonant Battles free to play guide. So last week we got promoted to Interval 19 and this time we've got Radiant Dawn and Awakening as the bonus titles. Which means that you can use Winter Altina, Summer Mia and Spring Mer as the harmonic units. But you only need two of them to get the optimal scoring. So this is my team and Cordelia is going to be the MVP here. You actually need to run Pass on her, her default skill, as it is going to be helping us at the end. And you need to have Blade Session Secret Seal so that you can maximize on her offensive power. So if you have a Cordelia who's heavily invested, then you could even try to run Fury here so that she can get some recall damage. But Triangle Adept here actually helps us a lot in taking out that Midori. So yeah, she's going to be helping us over here because Nisala just dies to Midori, unfortunately. And we need to have Raisin as our dancer with Wings of Mercy 2 and Attack Tactic. You don't really need version 3, so you can get version 2 from Emrin, from Frederick, from Pala. So there are a lot of units with Wings of Mercy 2. And you need to have Attack Tactic to buff up Cordelia. Then we've got a placeholder unit who has got drawback. And Sully already comes with that, so I've got her. And she's got Speed Tactic. So this could be the place where you can run some Mia or Spring Mer. If you're running Spring Mer, then you can also run Flyer Formation um, as the Sacred Seal so that you can teleport and then use Drawback. And finally, we have got a unit who can be replaced with any kind of Harmonic. So this could definitely be the place where you can run Winter Altina or uh, Spring Mer. So that is going to be our team. And it seems like without Harmonics, we are going to be going up to Interval 20, which is definitely a bit surprising to me because Let us go. weeks with uh, Winter Altina are pretty competitive. So you want to start by using drawback on your Cordelia and then having Oliver like this. And now Blade Session is fully active. Understood. So you can just take out this Midori. She actually almost uh, dies to two hits. But because this is interval 19, she doesn't fully die. And we can take a hit so that we can activate our Wings of Mercy. So you pretty much want to trigger Wings of Mercy here. Um, so at lower intervals, you could run maybe Fury on Cordelia. And like not use Blade Session fully. Do not move Oliver then. So that could be an option. And Speed Tactic and Attack Tactic are going to be buffing up Cordelia over here. So this guy should give you a general outline of how to go around this map. Unfortunately, Setsuna's weapon gives her no speed. So you just want to have your Cordelia drawn back. Have Oliver like this and just take out the Setsuna. And dance up Cordelia and take out this Red yes. Thief who does have Lightning Charm. So we can immediately use that. So we can end our turn and now we have got this Green Thief. Okay. So we can go ahead and just attack this Green Thief. Get the Gale Force off and actually move our Sully like this. So you want to go over here and take out this Green Thief by using your pass. And that is really important, honestly. So you're going to be getting Dance's Veil and you do want it to land on Cordelia. So it's a 50-50 coin flip and we do get her on the first try. Okay. So you want to just go ahead and break this obstacle. And go. then dance up Cordelia to finish off this Blue Thief to get the infantry boots. The Screen Thief is going to be trying to escape Understood. along with this Blue Thief. We can just take care of that Blue Thief and the Screen Thief Got it. can just have yes. their path blocked. So we can just wait for the Red Thief to come over here okay. and just take them out pretty easily. And now we have got this Green Thief coming over here. We can just go ahead and use our Infantry Boots. What now? And use a uh, Fortifying Horn. Understood. And just attack this uh, Green Thief. They have nowhere to run. So they're not even going to be moving. Yes. And that is going to be it for this week by taking out that Green Thief. So Cordelia doing a really fantastic job. That Triangle Adept and Pass actually helping. So that is amazing. I was actually surprised that I could use pass to a good use in this map. So hopefully you guys enjoyed and found this helpful. Make sure to share this video with your friends because this week's map can definitely be tricky because of Midori over here. Just making things a bit hard and then Fallen Male Corrin who definitely makes things hard. 
So hopefully you guys enjoyed, if you did then make sure to leave a like and a comment, helps me tremendously. And if you really really enjoyed then, you can always support me directly by using super thanks or by becoming a YouTube member. And for more resonant battles guides every single week, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Because YouTube sub boxes are about as functional as Oliver on this map. So that's it, I'll see you guys next time, thank you so much for watching and have a great day.